Let What's up, everybody? Slices. I'm Jameson. I'm Slice Squid. Corpse Morn. Welcome to ba Bad Publicity. <laughs> <Live there. laughs> blah, blah, blah. Bad Publicity. Bad Publicity. Bad. Today we're talking Bad about the Anarch... <laughs> Today we're talking about the Anarch resource, Scrubber. It's from the newest data pack. Um, we really haven't got much play into it yet, but... It's pretty I'm, easy to meta. I'm it's feeling that you are soon going to. I'm going to use it probably. I've got two influence that I'm uh, able to kind of play around with in my deck. I've kind of left it open to see what this new pack was like. I've, I've seen the spoilers, but I'm way more of a visual learner and planner, so I like having the card in my hand. Uh, let's me plan a little bit more. So I like this card. Um, I used to run Cyber Feeder. It splashes for the same amount, so I think it's really good for anybody who, use, who used Cyber Feeder before, but I went kind of away from using a rig. So, I like I like the two trashing value, um, and I think we're going to touch on a couple more topics. It, a little this stirred up a lot of controversy. So, Quartz doesn't get an opinion. No, people <laughs> people I'm setting them up. This, yeah, um, this turned out. Um, I'm going to knock them down. People exactly. people were discussing. Does this card replace Wizard? This card does not replace Wizard. Um, it certainly gives um, other personas the <clears throat> abilities that Wizard has, obviously. But this could potentially be compounded with Wizard. Most people play him because they like to just completely ruin people's rigs. And now you can do it even more efficiently and even quicker without don't you think hurting that was your bank. Like, that, don't you think that was the steam with Wizard? The fact that he was doing something that nobody else could do? Like, I think that's what mm -hmm. he's asking. Not, not if it... Like, obviously, having one of these in play and having the five trash value is amazing. But I mean, like... But like you're saying, now that now that Gabriel can run it, do you think that do you think that he's got that whole niche value under wraps? No, I wouldn't say under wraps because this is um, because you have to play it and because it is a resource, it's not a guarantee. So you may get it out, but it might not be there for long, right? Um, it's <sighs> Wizard out of the gate lets you basically ruin pad campaigns. Yeah, early game, ruin a lot of people's early game big, big time. And then even late game without breaking their bank, just trashing everything they're looking at without having to worry about it, right? So even if they don't have a huge bankroll on the go, just <laughs> running the R&D, flipping a card, and just, yeah, trash it. You got nothing else better to do, right? And you got that three bucks ready to spend. Well, now you potentially got five bucks ready to spend when paired with Wizard. Which is, I think it's pretty slick. I think because you use him in that way anyway to ruin people's rigs, now he just got that much more efficient. Yeah, anybody using encryption protocols, now you're not paying anything to trash their pad campaigns. Yeah. Encryption protocols are going to become more prevalent once uh, Director Haas comes out. Nobody's going to want to lose her. So I think, uh, think we've got a good card in our hands. So very low splash cost, you're putting it everywhere that you can? I think, I don't I, I mean, if, you, if you've got <clears throat> three card slots left and three influence, I can't see you not wanting to run something like this. Really? I don't feel like I would be putting three in a deck. I'm, I'm not in, I'm not completely in love with it, mm -hmm. um, simply because I have not yet used a deck that is, that has been kind of focused or even had a second focus of trashing mm -hmm. Um, people's rigs are trashing anything. Even it's a lot of times, you play all, criminals. You I have enough money yeah. to just trash their stuff anyway. If I really need to, but even then, I'm usually rather um, I'd rather keep the dollars and use that for more runs, right? Because we call them creds in this game. Creds, sorry, creds. So I'd rather keep the creds bad. and make some runs. So that's how. <laughs> It's whipping up all the net runner slang here. <laughs> this is this is how you attract women. This I do. Is how you do it. I do like it because it's credits that can't really be stolen as easy though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right, like, that's a good way to do it. Although you could trash the resource, you know, someone's not coming in and picking your pocket, busting your bank up. Yeah, that's a great way to look at it. But the, on the on the other side too, it it is a resource and it can be trashed. So it, it can go away. But you're right. I think it might be easier to lose because it's a resource than just actual hard credits. Because there's there's very few things in the game that, yeah. that can steal credits from, from, from the corporation. I would find it a lot easier to lose this runner. than a couple of bucks. Yeah. Right? So basically your point's null and by <laughs> no, So go on. I'm just, that's, no that's me. That's me. <laughs> <laughs> Making videos. All right. Do you... I don't know. I lost track. <laughs> <laughs> yes. 
<laughs> He's drumming through them off. Yeah. The uh, the rating. You hit us up first. Let's go. Uh, let's go in reverse order. Reverse order. Reverse order. Well, that should be. You should go first. You always go last. No, I'm no, I always go last. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna go first this time. This is awesome. So, um, this card for me. Um, while it is incredibly splashable, this could really go um, basically anywhere. If you feel like this is something that you want to be doing, if you feel like your persona could really do with trashing some stuff without having to worry about uh, losing any of the money that you need to run how you normally run, excellent choice of a card, obviously. So my final rating for this card, um, even though I'm not personally in love with it, but I see its potential, I'm probably going to hit it with a 5, 5 out of 7. Hmm. Yeah. So I'm last, then. or you're last, okay, so. All right, I like the card a lot. Um, again, I, I'm i probably gonna use it. I could see the power. I've been basically in love with Wizard since I saw him spoiled on uh, FFG, so. It's a physical appearance thing. Mostly. Yeah, I like the, yeah, the trench coat. It looks a lot like Kevin Smith, actually. He does, actually. <laughs> it's really he really cool. does. So, uh, I really like it, and I love the fact that now I can kind of have that, that playability. Um, I already, as a criminal player with bank job, I already really exploit uh, those remote servers uh, that aren't protected. But now this will just give me that extra. Once I want to run at them, now I'm not going to have to use that four dollars that I gain off a of bank job to make another run and trash the pad campaign. So this is just going to let me go and just keep some more of the money that I already spend. Because unlike Caleb, I do spend a lot of my money trashing trashing resources. Go quick. I think this card low splash. Uh, I'm not running three of them. I think he's a good addition to Wizard. He's not a replacement. Um, I, I, I'm just, it's not my style, but I do see potential. I'm going to have to give it a four out of seven. Oh, I didn't give a rating. Oh. Five. <laughs> <laughs> just like that. <laughs> just remember everything you said, then he hit you with a rating. <laughs> Beautiful. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Take care, guys. Comment and subscribe. Oh, yeah. Do all that stuff. Do it now. Post it on YouTube. Post Why? everything. Go on Facebook. <laughs> all right. We love you. Bye. <laughs>